Hi guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome. In today's video, we are going to be doing a skincare haul featuring the ordinary skincare products. I bought mine from Beauty Bay, so I will be listing all of the products down below. So if you want to grab any of them yourself, you know where to go. So I bought rather a lot of products just because I feel like I need a new skincare routine. I probably don't need all of these, probably went a bit overboard, but I need to up my game with my skincare because you know, I'm getting older, ain't getting any wiser. Everything needs sorting out and I need to take the reins. I'm gonna be unboxing the products I got and letting you know a bit about the product. Just to let you know, I am not a skincare professional, <laughs> as you can probably tell. <laughs> but I have done a little bit of research and this is just what I found about the product. So I'll let you know but do make sure that you do your own research because you know what it's like when you copy someone's test paper. Don't always do your favors, does it? <laughs> Especially if you're copying mine. If you are new here, I would love if you subscribe to my channel and stuck around for more. So just to show you what the products come like, they all come in the white packaging. Okay, so the first product, this is the Glycolic Acid 7% Toning Solution. And here's the little nozzle that goes on top when you're ready to open her up. I'm ready, I'm always ready. <laughs> this is a type of alpha hydroxy acid that exfoliates the skin. It does a mild exfoliation for skin radiance and texture. So it can brighten up your skin. Who doesn't want brighter skin? It contains Tasmanian pepperberry, aloe vera, and ginseng to reduce and soothe irritation. That sounds like a cell pitch. Not a very good one, but <laughs> it sounded like one. I'm looking forward to trying this product. And you get a fair bit of product for the price. All of the ordinary products are very well priced. The next product that we have, this is the Natural Moisturizing Factors Plus HA. So this is a natural skin hydrator and it's made up of compounds found naturally in the skin. It is non-greasy which we love. I'm a little bit of a grease ball, so a non-greasy moisturizer, gotta be the one. <gasps> Ooh, this is the product I'm really excited about. Ooh, we got a little bit of change of packaging now. Oh my God. This brings me back to science class. Hope I don't have any explosions on my face. Oh, actually, not a chemical explosion anyway. <laughs> this is the Caffeine Solution 5% plus EGCG. <laughs> Ooh, it's got a little dropper. Always be sure if you're dropping the product directly on your face, don't touch our skin because then not all of the nastiness gets on the dropper and then you put it back in. Not a fun time. So this is used to brighten dark circles and reduce the appearance of puffiness. I don't really suffer with puffy under eyes, but I do suffer with bags. I'm excited for this product because I'm gonna be starting night shifts soon. So I thought prevention better start it now. So this contains caffeine, which constricts the blood vessels to reduce discoloration and swelling. And what is EGCG, you might be asking? Wow, it is sourced from green tea and it has strong anti-inflammatory properties and is also proven to reactivate dying skin cells. Watch me go dig up my nan's grave and pour this on her. <laughs> It's Christmas! This is actually a repurchase. Do I have lipstick on my teeth? This is the niacinamide 10% plus zinc 1%. So this magic serum works to combat blemishes. It controls your sebum production to help pores remain clear and decon decongested <laughs> from bacteria that causes breakouts. So what does niacinamide do? Niacinamide improves your overall skin health boosts skin immunity and improves moisture retention. And what does zinc do? Zinc heals damaged skin and promotes production of collagen and elastin. So that keeps us looking young and fun. I love this product. It really does help with your like blackheads, pores, like mm, my pores were going through a really bad stage. You could have confused me with the moon with the amount of craters I had on my face anyway. <laughs> 
touchy subject. <laughs> Next product we have, this is Hyaluronic Acid 2% plus B5. This is a lightweight serum to rehydrate your dry ass, crusty ass skin. So the hyaluronic acid attracts up to a thousand times its weight in water. I'm gonna look so young and fun. I'm gonna just pour the whole bottle on. <laughs> and vitamin B5 hydrates and heals dry and damaged skin. And it also promotes growth of stronger tissue. This product is also a repurchase. Obviously I loved it, or why would I repurchase it? <laughs> I was about to explain that myself. This is the AHA 30% plus BHA 2%. Sorry baby, carry on. Oh. Well, just carry on as if I'm not here, no? <laughs> no. No, just carry on. This is... to interrupt, but I could hold that up for you. Dude, okay. Okay, I'm just saying. This is the oh. famous one that we all see on Instagram. The one that looks like you hit the time of your month, put it in a bottle to keep That's safe. That's <laughs> Yeah. That's no. disgusting. You knew I was coming in at this point. Okay, I want to go, but last time you put me on the camera, so turn the camera. You're so good. You're so good. I love you. Thanks. Thank you. Can I come put? Oh! Are you okay? <laughs> Back to this little beauty. This is an exfoliating pill. Do not leave this on any longer than 10 minutes unless you wanna have an accident. <laughs> and look like Larry the Lobster, hey Lexi. <laughs> so this exfoliates the top layer of skin for a brighter and clearer complexion. It fights visible blemishes and with continued use of this, it reduces the size of your pores and fine lines. But this is not for sensitive skin. So if you're a bit sensitive, you're a little bit on the sensitive side, maybe skip this. But I would highly recommend this product that was gonna, not gonna be a smooth transition. Okay, next product. <laughs> this is retinol 0.5% in squalene. I'm pretty sure I'm saying that right. This is an anti-aging serum with plant-derived squalene. It's designed to minimize fine lines and reduce the signs of aging. I feel like I've said that for every project, for every product. So there are different concentrates of retinol you can get with the Ordinary. There is a 0.2, a 0.5 and a 1%. They do recommend to start the lowest and work your way up. I have used retinol before with another brand. So I went for the middle man. Obviously the higher percentage of retinol, the harsher the product's gonna be. <laughs> so as you build up a tolerance to retinol, you can up your dosage. You do want to use it with caution because this can cause irritation and peeling and it can even cause purging to your skin, but purging for your skin is actually good. It's like climbing up hill. Once you get over that hill and it's all downhill, you know, it's smooth sailing from there. But purging isn't the nicest of things to go through because you're gonna have broken out. <laughs> but eventually after the purging, your skin will be better. And this is just a sign of your skin adjusting to the product. So yeah, I'm excited to try this. We are moving on to our last but not least product. This is 100% cold press rose hip seed oil. That was a mouthful. This is a pure blend of cold press and organic rose hip oil, which hydrates and supports healthy skin. Rose hip oil is renowned for its anti-inflammatory and regenerative properties. It helps to calm redness, hydrate skin, treat scars and burns, brighten skin, <laughs> and regenerate damaged tissue. They actually use rose hip oil in hospitals for uh, like burns victims, they will use this. Not this, <laughs> but they'll use rose hip oil <laughs> because that's how renowned it is for its like regenerative properties. So I'm really excited to give this one a go because I need some help. That was my haul from The Ordinary. I'm excited to get my skin care routine going and flowing. This isn't gonna be my whole routine. Obviously, I'm not gonna use all of these products every single night. So you know, you can switch it up. One day you can use one thing, another day you can use another thing and just see what works for your skin. And I also will have other things in my skincare routine like a cleanser, SPF, don't forget your SPF. And yeah, that's about it. I didn't get a cleanser from The Ordinary because they're all sold out and I didn't get an SPF from The Ordinary, unfortunately, but next time, I make an order, I'll definitely try one of their SPFs. But yeah, that is it for today's haul. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe or else 
thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye!